All right, so we got another PTR patch notes with just some small adjustments from the previous one here. Uh, I believe this released like yesterday. And I guess the biggest change is, I mean, apart from the re reverting a couple things, is that they're changing Moonwell mana regeneration. Now, I guess in the past, Moonwell regen actually used to be what 1.25 is that what i saw yeah yeah it used to be 1.25 so this is technically more than that but when i think about how elf is currently played i find that oftentimes at least in the early to mid game your moon wells are just always empty. <laughs> so I don't know. This this seems kind of harsh. Uh, I believe the math works out. Uh, I, I believe I saw somewhere that the math works out to like 39, 36 or something mana through a night cycle per moon well. But that is fairly relevant, especially in the first couple night cycles. You know, later night cycles might not manage, uh, might not matter as much, because you may have like rejuves and you may have moon wells that are already full. But you might not even get there, or some strategies will fall behind as well. So, like talent strategies, for instance, rely on making three to four moon wells pretty early blocking off their base but also relying on them to defend so that they can go straight into talons against like orc for instance but now if your moon wells are all getting this less mana let's say 90 to 150 less mana that's pretty relevant that's a lot of either healing or mana that you could have had and no longer do for your heroes and it could end up costing you you know, extra potions or heal scrolls or something just to heal up. And I don't know, I, I personally think this is a bad change because I feel like with all of the other changes going out there, you don't really want to nerf something that's like a baseline for Elf, right? Elf currently relies on having enough healing to be able to do the things they want to do. But if you take away that baseline healing and you're nerfing other aspects of elf and buffing other aspects of other races, like Night Elf just kind of plummets from that. This is a much more tame nerf than this, for instance. So basically this small update decided Night Elf wasn't being nerfed enough, even though they're being completely nerfed while other races are getting complete buffs apart from one small nerf for like undead but oh wait oh wait now this small nerf for undead is even smaller they're like you know maybe that was too much we still want to buff undead or not really buff them but you know keep them mostly buffed right in line with human and orc and then just completely destroy night elf why not and so that's that's kind of where we're sitting now um anyways i think these these being reverted is good this seems unnecessary Nerubian all already i feel like mostly is or i feel like it's best against elf currently uh one because it does extra damage to archers first of all and is basically free kills on archers because they're so low health and two because i feel like undead is most likely to expand against elf maybe maybe it affects quite a lot against human as well but yeah, maybe against elf and human, this matters the most. But like, 
<laughs> with Elf getting nerfed and Undead getting mostly buffs. I thought I thought the general consensus is people wanted Elf to be slightly better against Undead in some ways. You know, maybe maybe nerf certain things like a Demon Hunter against Undead, but buff other aspects against the Undead race. Or have nerfs on Undead to, you know, balance them together. But this is just... This is complete elf nerf and undead, you know, buffs apart from this. So it seems kind of, kind of bad. Anyways, I mean, that, that's really all there is. The rest of the changes have stayed the same. But yeah, I think the Moonwell regen is a bad way to go about it. Like I said, it's kind of the baseline right now. This is what you re are relying on. Currently, for instance, uh, I will oftentimes run out of moon wells against human and sometimes undead and sometimes orc. Literally all three of the other races. On my first like, you know, few moon wells I have. And I'm also someone who invests in the third moon well earlier than most other people. So thinking about that, I'm like, yo, you kind of just get screwed over early game which will allow all the other races to do even more of what they want, which, by the way, human already fast expands in Elf's face. Uh, Undead also fast expands in Elf's face, and Orc sometimes just wants to trade early and train your Moonwows and then do their creeping later with Shadowhunter and then push you. It seems rough. But we'll see how it goes. That's that's about it. Feels bad, man. Uh, time to become paladin rifle players. Feels good, man. 